This is it, y'all, that I live my life. On the mic is my type of hype. Yeah, it's only right. This is it. To set this one up, you know, this was um, one of the first times probably that I was able to work with someone that uh, I grew up listening to, right? So I was in a group called Name. Uh, we ran around the streets of Philadelphia hard from like 95 to 98. <clears throat> and uh, at that time, there wasn't even a grand agent, you know, so somewhere in late 97, 98, the grand agent name and brand or whatever you want to call it came to be. <clears throat> so artist of the year was like a name record basically and it was kind of I mean it's, we didn't know at the time but it was kind of like the height of our time together right I think I had already started the Grand Asian solo album or I don't know but anyway so we get school ED in there and we get wise intelligent from poor righteous teachers and um, you know we kind of do this joint that that's like um, for us it's like we ready to go right like we had we had kind of made a, a way and a name for ourselves in the, in the underground scene but like we was kind of super far left so all our conversations with record companies at that time were like we don't know what to do with it i mean they still tell artists that today i'm sure we don't know what to do with it we don't know how to market it yada 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 and i think on this one we had all kind of felt confident that we packaged what we were in a way that nobody would be able to say i don't get that and then we had the the co-sign the school ed and then we had the co-sign of wise intelligent you know poor righteous teachers are already um legendary at that time and we get this joint together and uh i don't know what the conversations were but in the end we ended up putting it out ourselves again so um and it's ironic right artist of the year artist of the year a play on that and um what I learned coming up in Philly is like, um, you got to make a way for this stuff to get out there. You know, it's not, um, you know, the business is not guaranteed. You know, e even if you get on and you get hot, the next record, the business is not guaranteed. So if you're an artist and you create really for the sake of creating, then you're going to make a way um, to, to get it out there. So that commitment in, in and of itself kind of made us the artist of the year in, in, in our own minds. So, so, you know, shout out to Wise, shout out to Culture, shout out to PRT, you know, Father Shaw, rest in peace. Shout out to Schoolie D, and shout out to my name, brothers. You know, Ozzy and, and Sizz, and um, yeah, that was a pivotal moment for us and a, and a, a pivotal lesson. And I think I was able to, to go forward with that and everything I did from that point on. So, artist of the year, name, that's what happened. This is it, y'all, that I live my life on the mic. It's my type of hype. Yeah, it's only right. Where you at? 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 Where you at?